Hello, I'm Gil Zilka. Welcome to my channel. This is my series entitled Essential Classical Music, where we look at the best recordings of the major classical music works. This video is taken from my larger video entitled uh, Best Recordings of Orchestral Works, uh, where I look at uh, basically all orchestral music uh, that is not including the symphonies or the concertos. So if you like this video, I hope you'll take the time to view that one as well. Uh, just know that uh, it is divided into chapters, so you don't have to watch the entire thing at one, one sitting. Uh, you can just very easily click on whichever work that uh, you're curious about. So I hope you enjoy it. All right, so now we are moving on to uh, the letter C. <laughs> and uh, we're going to go back to Again, the American side of the Atlantic, and maybe America's most celebrated classical composer, Aaron Copland. Uh, the thing about Copland is he really uh, created a sound world that was that was uh, distinguished as being American. Um, I was discussing earlier that we're going to be talking about a lot of tone poems, which is music that emphasizes less uh, structure and melody and is more about being descriptive. And the, the, uh, the uh, description of the American landscape with Copeland's work, especially with his masterpiece, uh, The Appalachian Spring, uh, is, is something that really distinguishes him. And uh, my prime recommendation for Copeland orchestral works is, no surprise, this is the, the, the old classic. This is Leonard Bernstein, the composer's friend, with the New York Philharmonic, uh, recorded in very good stereo in the early 60s. And uh, here you get the Appalachian Spring in a very warm, uh, sympathetic, uh, 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 very vibrant uh, interpretation. And uh, you also get the Fanfare for the Common Man, which is another famous Copeland work. You know, it goes bum bum bum, ba ba bum, dum dum dum. Dun, dun, dun. You know, most of us have probably heard that one uh, done very well and with lots of passion in this one. And you also get a couple of, uh, again, descriptive American Western landscape pieces, uh, Rodeo and, and Billy the Kid, which are also wonderfully done. So this is really a no brainer if you're wanting to get to know Copeland for the first time. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, uh, I hope you'll also take time to click the like and subscribe buttons. And with that, I want to wish you all a great day and happy listening.